so I, I'm, I'm trying to talk a little bit about how, how to get your job done while, while trying to remain sane. I don't know if uh, some of you had this, uh, similar experiences. Uh, I've been working at a couple of companies as a contractor, consultant, whatever you want to call it. Um, so I had a couple of experiences with, with how various companies uh, work <coughs> regarding to, to version control, for example. So I, I have a couple of these clients that they uh, don't really know what version control is. So they just don't have it. Uh, they sort of think, if you are if you're good enough, then, then you just have to write the code, right? If, if, if you need version control, then you're probably not good enough. <laughs> Coming into a company is starting to face this thing is, is a bit, bit hard. And, but then there are better companies. So there are these companies that that, that, that already know how to use version control. They, they know how to know, they, they know it's important. Uh, so they tell you that okay, so to just write your code, and when, when you're done, like, like three months from now, then check into your version control system <laughs> because they, they, they need that. So there is a couple, a couple of these companies that use it like a backup. And that's, that's for, for backup is not really good after three months. Um, so, uh, but then there are really good companies that, that they already know that they, you have to to to, to have version control. So they install this, this whole procedure of how you uh, ask for permission to commit to version control today. So it will take like a half an hour, an hour, uh, just to commit to version control and, and it will just really kill uh, the use of some of most of the people. Just won't do it. Uh, and then there are other companies. So I was consulting for this company and they brought me in as an expert in testing. I, I don't know why, but uh, and they, they, I managed to sell it to them. So they brought me in to improve their, their testing, their, their, their pro system, their coding. Uh, so I started uh, out with this thing and then, then my boss was changed or replaced by someone else. And then uh, for sometimes he didn't talk to me, but I, I grabbed him. I, I, I have to talk to my boss after all. And then uh, his first sentence was, uh, you know, I don't believe in pretty testing. <laughs> <laughs> so I, just, and I don't know what does he believe in, but, but uh, I thought, Maybe it's not the right place for me now. <laughs> so, but anyway, um, is this familiar to you? Like, have you been to similar places? But, ever. Anyway, so one of the solutions is just to, to find better place. Okay, you just go and then leave. And, and, and if you're worried that, that maybe it's difficult to find, uh, so there are a couple of companies here looking for people. And uh, yeah. I, I would like to take this chance to, to thank uh, the supporter to to sponsor my trip here, so thank you very much. <laughs> uh, and I'm already thanking that, that last time for more kidding as well, we organized this whole thing. So. <laughs> not, not for everyone, I mean, uh, not everyone can change a, a, a workplace. So let's try to see, uh, see how uh, we might improve our, our situation. So, so just to create a small island, of sanity and this, this whole thing of, of this company where we are working. So we can just actually use version control or by yourself. So I've been using start version for a long time, but Git actually, uh, and I've started to use it recently, is pretty good at, at setting up, you don't need a server for it. So you just can create your own Git repository locally. And you don't have to tell your boss that you're actually using version control. It's <laughs> frightening. <laughs> So you just can silently use your version control, and if they use a version control, so for some version, you can interface it, and, and you can push like once a month to their repository, <laughs> so to kill that calm that they, they they understand that you know how to use a version control system, and in the meantime you can use your, your own own Git repository. And if you think that that uh, Git is complex, then go do testing. <laughs> so try testing. That's opera question. Yeah. <laughs> uh, sorry, um, English. <laughs> 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 okay, so write your right test and, and testing is a good because uh, it has a short uh, time period that, that you invest in that, and long run that when you're actually harvesting your investment. And you can set up a smoke server. Then you can grab the, the uh, version controls, uh, the, the new versions from other people, like you know, once a month, and then test it for yourself. You don't have to talk to anyone about this. You just do it for yourself, and you know that the investment pays off because you keep staying in the same company. Um, and then you can start slowly enlarge this island and maybe tell to someone, not to your boss because he's going to be afraid, <laughs> but to other, other people maybe uh, explain how, how it works and how you improve things and, and so on. And, 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 
because you, you, you have invested all these things and you, now you're saving time basically because you have all these unit tests. And uh, so you have time for other things. So now you can go and, and subscribe to Pro Beacon. <laughs> <laughs> and if you don't have the, the oh, then you can also have the test already. And check out the 